hello everybody welcome back to my channel we are in brussels belgium and i thought i would do a little like night routine kind of thing this is our second country third city no <laughs> this is our second country that we stayed in a hotel in or yeah second i can't remember half the time but um so i wanted to kind of show you guys what we've been doing like towards the end of the day um and then just like you know our little just like a little routine kind of thing so we just got in from a long day and we're going to settle down tomorrow's or today's actually our last day in belgium um and we go to italy tomorrow so um we're kind of packing up right now this conditioner that i had spilled everywhere so that's awesome try to rinse that off and i guess find a new conditioner um bottle but anyway so we're gonna pack. I'll show you guys like my skincare I've been doing lately. We've been out in the sun all day, every day. So I'll show you like SPF and stuff that I use. And then just like show you guys us packing and all the good stuff, so. Okay, so here's our packing situation. This is my suitcase. I know in my packing video that I said we're taking one suitcase, but then it dawned on me that's heavier. Sorry, bad lighting. It's actually heavier to have one suitcase, so it makes more sense to do two, so it's lighter, and Kenny gets to check them back. I get to check him back, so. You know what I mean? That makes sense. So, like I said, this is my suitcase. There's Kenny. And then this is Kenny's suitcase. We're gonna put the rest of our toiletries in here, and then we have two backpacks that we carry on onto the plane. So, there's our blankies. And then this is all gonna go. This is my purse that I've been wearing a lot of lately. All right, so we decided to just not go to dinner tonight, and we just got something um, since it's our last day here, and we both and we all have to pack. So I'm gonna eat my leftovers. We went to this like Korean like fried chicken place. We, this is my sec second time there. Even Kenny said it was good. And he doesn't like anything. You see chicken? It's like uh, sweet and sour chicken is what they call it. I only got like a few left, but. And then some kimchi. I'm not feeling their kimchi today. The other day it was pretty good. And then I got some rice. Some chopsticks. They don't have a microwave here, so I'm gonna eat it cold. Yum. It's so good. For this trip, I um, sorry, my hair's on the way. So, before I left for this trip, I ordered I wanted to have like a skincare where everything was the same, and I'm kind of like trying out new things right now. Uh, so, I ordered this this um, Tula skincare. This is pro the probiotics and superfood. Um, it's like it's the cult classic purifying face cleanser, and it's very gentle on the skin. I've already used it, so I'm not gonna use it again. Um, I'll put this back in here because we're leaving in the morning. Um, and then I'll go in with, um, this is the Probiotics and Superfoods. It's the Rose Glow and Get It Cooling and Brightening Eye Balm. I've never been the type to have like an under eye cream, which I heard is really bad, by the way. Um, but this feels super good under the skin or under the eyes. And I like take it down here. It honestly, it smells like a glue stick. I will say. So I don't know what that means. Um, and then I'll just rub it under here. Very gently. But it just like gives like a really nice pick me up and then it just makes the under eyes really smooth. I don't think it really does anything with wrinkles, but I assume like since it's moisturizing, it probably helps. Wrinkles, don't quote me on that. I'm not a dermatologist. Um, and then I like to go in with 
the brightening treatment drops this has triple vitamin c it's triple it says it's triple vitamin c serum this is what it looks like not the best and then i'll mix it in with the tula's um protecting glow daily sunscreen and this has spf 30 in it Do this little number. Boom. Put about that much. And SPF is super important, not just for your whole body, but I would say especially for your face. Granted, you get skin care, I mean skin cancer any anywhere on your body. But come on girls, I know you guys want to have nice skin when you're old. At least I do. So I'll just do like a about this much and do like this I'm like bending over because there's not any really where anywhere to put my camera so I'll bring it down my neck and I'll make sure to get what I have here and just bring that down my neck so far it's super hydrating it's not oily it doesn't feel greasy on my skin either uh, and I'll just, I'll use this um, in the mornings and at night. And I'll put the rest of it here. And that's it. Okay, so next I'm gonna do my hair. Crazy fancy, but I use this Moroccan argan oil silky serum. This is what it looks like. And I'll start on my ends first. Eventually, I'm gonna do a whole hair care routine. Because um, as you all know, I perm my hair. Um, and I'm still just trying to kind of work out the kinks of what I like to do, like when washing, and I'll put some of my fingertips and like put it on the head here. Um, just like my whole washing routine, I'm just hair washing routine, I'm just still figuring that out. So bear with me. I know you want to see a hair care routine, but I don't want to really show it until I know for sure if I like it. So if I don't want to slick my hair, I'll put this motion solution. Love this stuff. This is my third bottle. So I love this. clothes on for tomorrow since we have such an early morning we literally have to be out of here by like 3 50 and catch our flight at 6 30 so that's what's gonna be uh, but that's pretty much what we do in the afternoons um nothing fancy you know thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys in italy bye guys <laughs>